much. We have the greatest country in the world. Thank you very much, everybody. We're going to keep it nice and safe. The President held up the Bible the other day in Washington, D.C. Here in New York, we actually read the Bible, and there are some passages that I think are especially appropriate for today and this time of where we are. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called children of God, Matthew 5. If a house be divided against itself, that house cannot stand. That was Mark 3, actually, before Abraham Lincoln. Turn away from evil and do good. Search for peace and work to maintain it. Psalms 34. The seed whose fruit is righteousness <clears throat> is sown in peace by those who make peace. I think those words are all appropriate for where we are today. It's another quote that I think is uh, applicable to where we are today. You can't use the military as a political weapon. Do you remember who said that? I said that. There's another quote. The option to use active duty forces in law enforcement, use forces in a law enforcement role, should only be used as a matter of last resort and only in the most urgent and dire of situations. We are not in one of those situations now. I do not support invoking the Insurrection Act. Do you know who said that? Secretary of Defense Mark Esper, appointed by President Trump. You can't set fire to the House and then claim you are the one trying to put out the flames. Do you know who said that? You guys are not well read. That I can tell you. A.J. Parkinson said that. 